This is an historic house in Worthington uh, that was built by, in this part, Aurora Buttles in 1811, and then in the front part in 1819 by Orange Johnson. We, uh, the Historical Society keeps this site open uh, most of the months of the year for visitors to come and enjoy a step back in time to understand what a pioneer house was like and what the lifestyle of that era was. And also, uh, as the town grew and Orange Johnson built the front part of the house, how the town of Worthington prospered. This is the, this is the kitchen of the Orange Johnson house. Uh, this would have been the living room, family room, dining room, uh, an all-purpose room for the family to gather and do its chores. The spinning wheel was brought by the first family that uh, migrated from Connecticut, the Griswolds. The Griswold Inn was on the northeast corner of the green, and the inn stood for many, many years and actually was the first project of the group that became the Historical Society in an effort to save the old buildings that were disappearing in town. So the Griswold Inn unfortunately couldn't be saved, it was too far gone. We did benefit greatly by its demise because this house was in shambles and some of the furniture came here and as well the spindles and this return between the second and third floor of the Griswold Inn all fit exactly, same carpenter. All of the spindles and the both staircases that you'll see uh, were all part of the Griswold Inn. So you know, we've now gone from pioneer style house to federal and one of the things that was done during the restoration in the 60s was to uh, leave this window into the attic so you can see that they never took the bark off the trees that are supporting the roof. And the federal part of the house was built in 1819 by the Johnsons. So the furnishings that you see in here kind of reflect the era when the Johnsons were living here but we don't go even towards Civil War time. We excavated this part to have a museum room. And so some of the possessions of the oldest families in Worthington are displayed in these cases. This whole area reflects things that kids can come and do, understanding that this was a farm, and here's pictures of log houses that were built here. There are uh, samples of quilt blocks that one of our wonderful volunteers made. The internet has connected us to numerous people who've been able to, to Google Orange Johnson and find out there's a house or, or Kilburn or, you know, these early people. And so descendants sometimes have things that are sent to us. And in this case, um, a lady in the South had contacted us and said, I have this coffer, would you like it? And we said, oh, absolutely. And um, also the packet of letters that we received over a hundred documents and they were in a little tin valise and so just when you think you'll never know anything more about the history of this house, the people of Worthington or something, here comes something else. So it's, it's really kind of fun.